Are you considering using a baby swing for your little one, but aren't sure if it's safe? You're not alone, and we're here to help. In this video, we'll go over all the important safety considerations when it comes to using a baby swing. Hi there and welcome to Yardy Baby. If you're looking for daily tips on all things baby related, then you're in the right place. Make sure to subscribe for more helpful content. Today, we're tackling an important topic, is it safe to use a baby swing? As new parents, it's natural to have concerns about the products we use for our little ones, and we want to make sure that everything is as safe as possible. Baby swings can be a great way to soothe and entertain your little one, but it's important to use them properly to ensure their safety. Before we dive into the specifics, it's worth noting that the American Academy of PD at Tricks AP advises against using any type of infant seats, carriers, or swings for routine sleep. These products are not designed for sleep, and the AAP advises that the safest place for a baby to sleep is on a firm, flat surface, such as a crib or bassinet. However, if you do decide to use a baby swing, here are some things to keep in mind. Follow the manufacturer's guidelines. Each baby swing will have specific weight and age limits, so make sure to follow these guidelines to ensure that your baby is using the swing safely. The swing should also be placed on a flat, stable surface and should not be used on an elevated surface, such as a table or counter. Keep an eye on your baby. While it's tempting to use the swing as a way to keep your baby occupied while you get things done, it's important to always keep a close eye on them while they are in the swing. In the event of a problem, you'll want to be able to react quickly and remove your baby from the swing if necessary. Use the safety straps. Most baby swings come with safety straps to keep your baby securely in place. Make sure to use these straps every time your baby is in the swing and adjust them so that they fit your baby snugly. It's also important to regularly check the straps to ensure that they are in good condition and properly secured. Don't leave your baby in the swing for too long. It's important to give your baby breaks from the swing and to engage with them regularly. Prolonged periods of time in the swing could potentially cause developmental delays, as babies need opportunities to move and explore their environment in order to grow and learn. The AP recommends that babies be placed in a safe and supervised play area when they are awake, and that they should not be left alone in an infant seat, carrier, or swing. Choose a swing with a sturdy design. When shopping for a baby swing, look for one that is sturdy and well-made. Avoid swings with loose or dangling parts that could potentially become a hazard, and look for swings that have a five-point harness or other safety features. It's also a good idea to read reviews and check the safety ratings of different swings before making a purchase. Don't rely on the swing as a substitute for proper supervision. While a baby swing can be a helpful tool for soothing and entertaining your little one, it's important to remember that it is not a substitute for proper supervision. Always keep a close eye on your baby, and never leave them unattended in the swing. In conclusion, it is safe to use a baby swing as long as you follow the manufacturer's guidelines. Keep a close eye on your baby, use the safety straps, and don't leave your baby in the swing for extended periods of time. Always prioritize your baby's safety and well-being. It's also important to remember that the AAP advises against using any type of infant seat, carrier, or swing for routine sleep, and that the safest place for a baby to sleep is on a firm, flat surface. When shopping for a baby swing, be sure to choose one that is sturdy and well-made, with a five-point harness or other safety features. Read reviews and check safety ratings before making a purchase, and always follow the manufacturer's guidelines. And remember, while a baby swing can be a helpful tool, it should never be used as a substitute for proper supervision. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more helpful baby tips.